At Jackson Springs, for 19 years, we've also offered the best water coolers that are available in the marketplace today. I know that when you're out and about, you'll see, you know, water coolers here, water coolers there, and a lot of times people don't know what the difference is. So as I said before, an educated consumer is our best customer. First of all, we've sold this cooler line made in Canada for the past 19 years. These water coolers have a five-year warranty on them which is exceptional for a $300 appliance, especially from a company that's all they've made for over the, all the years that they've been in business. What we've experienced is many people get 10 to 15 years out of them. If the water cooler is going to be in an area where you've got any windows whatsoever, direct or indirect light, you should select a water cooler with a cover. The, the cover will protect the integrity of the water from natural light. I'm sure some of us have had fish tanks when we were kids and we put them in a window, Worst spot you could ever have it. Everything went offside. The cover protects the integrity of the water. Second point is, is the cover is also beneficial from preventing dust from getting into the non-spill area. Uh, so if you have pets or if it's a dusty area, a cover is certainly beneficial. Also, from an aesthetic standpoint, sometimes people or a lot of times people have wonderful, great looking kitchens and they have an ugly water cooler. Of course, this is quite the compliment to that kitchen. It's beautiful. I think it's the most attractive water cooler money can buy. But let's get down to the important points. First of all, this has a full-size Energy Star compressor, not one that's about the size of a tin of beans. It'll last long. It's very effective at cooling the water to whatever temperature you like. The temperature is adjustable to meet your own preference. Next thing I'd like to po uh, point out is it has a non-spill system. Basically what happens is this is not a scenario where a consumer would have to remove the cap. All they do is remove the safety seal, of course, when it's on the jug. And then what happens is this is punctured uh, and the water is released into that area. What I'd also like to point out as well is if the cooler doesn't completely disassemble, don't buy it. Because just like we as a company sterilize each and every jug, you need to sterilize what the water is being dispensed from uh, three to four times per year. These taps remove just as simple as this. Now that you can properly clean and sterilize with the solution that's included with every water cooler you buy from Jackson Springs. Not only do we have the non-spill, is it has another little device in the bottom. That is actually called a leak guard. It's the only water cooler in the marketplace today that has one. All of our jugs are all leak tested. If there ever was a crack jug, and I've never had one in 19 years myself, but anyways, it's a good feature. This rises and shuts off the flow of water. The other thing that's important to note as well is the bowl that chills the water is food grade stainless steel. Not only is it more sanitary, but it has a significant impact to the taste of the water. So if you want our water to taste like a million bucks in your home, select a water cooler with a food grade stainless steel bowl. So we have a complete line of water coolers that are available in our marketplace today. Even if you don't buy this particular model or a brand from us, bar none, it's the best water cooler money can buy. I encourage you to spend a little bit more. You'll be happier and it'll be cheaper in the long run. Now what I'd like to show you is what you don't want when you're shopping for a water cooler. First of all, you can see by this example, this is a Sunbeam. A lot of times they're the same, just a different name on them. But here's a jug that's badly contaminated because the water's been blazing in the light. But what becomes more evident as we've discussed the importance of sterilizing a water cooler is, is the impact that it can have to your taste and the impact that it can have to your health. Here's a store-bought unit where uh, someone wondered why the water didn't taste very good. Take a look inside. It's full of mold, it's full of bacteria, full of algae. Water coolers need to be sterilized three to four times per year and be protected from light. If it's not done, this is what happens. But if it's this dirty here, how dirty do you think it is inside those taps? These type of taps being from a store-bought model do not remove. 
as I showed you with ours, they can. So even if we were to dump something really, really strong through, which might affect your health eventually, there's no way we can sterilize inside those tops. So choose a water cooler that has a cover, if it's gonna be an area with light, choose a water cooler that easily disassembles that you, so we can properly clean and sterilize it, and also with removable tops. Many people today as well are talking about, oh, the bottom load cooler, the bottom load cooler, it's self-cleaning. It's not true, okay? Ozone is used, and ozone is used to sterilize what area? Just the bowl itself. And if you've ever consumed water from a self-cleaning water cooler that didn't taste right, that's because it just went through an ozone cycle. You don't want to drink that. Also, what I'd like to point out is, is that the tops are non-removable. They're simply push buttons. Bottom line is you can't clean what you can't get at. Inside, we take a look, and with a bottom load water cooler, there's a spigot that goes inside the jug. Typically, you run your hand down this area, and it's all slimy. You don't want that. So although it might be convenient, it probably won't be healthy for you. So bottom line is, Spend $25 or $50 more, buy a water cooler that suits your needs, buy a water cooler that comes apart so you can properly clean and sterilize it, and also choose a water cooler that's going to make your water taste as good as it can possibly be.